Hi, uh, I am going to teach math method for year 11 and year 12 students. So uh, before I teach you anything else, I have to introduce you some uh, mathematical symbols that will also will always be used in your year 11 and year 12 uh, studies. Okay, I just write them down first. The first simple means belongs to means belongs to and the second simple R means real number real numbers uh, are numbers from minus infinity to uh, infinity basically uh, all the numbers you're going to uh, all the numbers yes uh, just to make it simple we say it is all the all the numbers okay if you're going to do a specialist math and uh, you will be learning something with an imaginary number which is not real number but in math method all we uh, dealing with is real numbers okay okay this simple means except except so I, sh I will well, do some examples later to show you how do we use those symbols and uh, uh, what does it actually mean okay the last simple means all okay for for example, if I well, uh, if I write down x belongs to R uh, except zero. Okay, this means x. This means x can be uh, any real number, but not zero. Okay means x can be any number but not zero okay if I have x belongs to uh, 5 or 10 it means x can only be 5 or 10 okay so x uh, for instance x cannot be 6, six 7 or 11 in this case okay some more simple are circle bracket and uh, square bracket okay. for instance I use a circle bracket this time x is belongs to circle bracket 0 to 10 okay. this means x is greater than 0 but sorry x is greater than 0 but less than 10 And if I have square bracket, it means x is greater than or equal to 0 and less or equal than 10. Okay, the difference between a circle bracket and a square bracket just with the equal sign here okay. uh, yeah. now I'm going to introduce you some uh, concept mathematical concept of domain and range okay uh, 
in math method, most of your problems are associated with graphs, whether you're drawing graphs or analyzing graphs. Okay, and uh, for example, well, just before you do anything with graphs, you have to be certain what is the domain and the range of the graph. Okay, I do an example to show you that. Okay. For instance, if I have a graph like this, okay, I draw a graph here. That's your x axis, y axis, and uh, this point is minus 2 to minus 3, and this point is uh, okay, 5 to 10. Okay, and uh, uh, the circle bracket here is different from the circle bracket, um, has different meaning. The circle bracket here means coordinates. So it means this the origin from here, and uh, it means it traveled 5 units to the right and 10 units up at this point. So 5. Travel two units to the left from the origin, which is zero, so it's minus two, and in this point is minus three. Okay. The domain, uh, basically the line is our graph, and uh, uh, well, I have a, I, I draw the open circle at this end and uh, a and cl closed circle at the other end. So what does this mean is the open circle here is means the uh, okay the point minus two minus three is not included in the graph, but when I draw a closed circle, a fully colored black closed circle, it means the point five ten is included in the graph. Okay. The domain is basically uh, your x value. What your x value can be in this graph. Uh, if we look at the graph, the x value can be any number from minus 2 to 5. It cannot be, for instance, minus 10 because when x is minus 10, there's nothing there. There's, there's no graph. So. The way to write it down is domain is x belongs to from minus 2 to 5 and the square bracket because this point is included we use the open bracket means uh, this open circle here because this point minus 2 3 minus 3 is not included in the graph okay and uh, we do the same thing with range. Range is y from, uh, well, basically range is your vertical value. Domain is your horizontal span, uh, yes, horizontal span of the graph from minus 2 to 5. Range is your vertical span, which is minus 3 to 10. Okay, oh, well, same. Uh, with the same concept, we use uh, open circle is minus 3 to 10 with a closed circle there. Okay. Uh, okay, I just write some notes. When you say, uh, when you say uh, it's very important, when you say an uh, open circle at the end of a graph, it means the point. The point is not included. Okay. 
if we draw a circle with with well uh, circle with a dot fully colored circle it means the point is included in the graph okay now we look some uh, we look some more uh, well we look some more examples about domain and range okay